Hello there, I'm Nathan May Cooper, and today I'm going to show you how you can make macros in, on the Strike Eagle MKI3 gaming keyboard by Armageddon. Uh, it's a keyboard that's quite small, it's 10 keyless, meaning that it has no kind of a uh, numpad at the right, as you can see. Sorry. Also, it has uh, red MX Cherry switches, which are probably the lightest switches out of any. Um, recently, they've, s they've surged a bit in, um, in popularity. They used to be kind of... Uh, overshadowed by the black switches, but now uh, they're kind of coming through as a potential gaming switch. Well, I'm again picked up on this, of course, and uh, made this keyboard. It's very good. And uh, it was actually the one that I used at the Armageddon CSGO finals. And uh, I was very pleased with the, with the keyboard the whole time. Uh, this is what it sounds like. Sorry for the Windows sound again. So it sounds like that. It's very easy to press the buttons, and they have a linear feel. Okay, so when you open the drivers, you'll uh, you'll come to this screen showing you a picture of the keyboard, some features, and a little description there. And uh, so I'm going to show you how to make macros. So we go into this macro setting bit, and basically, as you can see along this bit here, all these M buttons, they are all the buttons that you can macro to something. So personally, uh, I'll come to this one, this M1. And I'll hit go over and assign a macro. You see, I've already got a few. And uh, we'll do the, the two flashbangs because that's an interesting one compared to what I've been doing. So, two flashbangs is what I'll uh, do. So, two flashbangs for CSGO. So, I'll delete this one now. Yes, I do. And then I'll click new. And I'll say bye to flash. Okay. So, now that's set up. It's an empty macro, you need to record something over it, so you click start record, and now we're in record mode, so I'll hit B63, B63. Hit it twice to buy two flashes, and that should be it. So now I click OK, and then I come back to this M1 bit, I hit assign a macro, and then buy two flash. Hit apply. You saw on the bottom right, it told me I loaded profile 1, and now it's done, so when I go into game, it'll buy two flashes. I'm Nathan Nick Cooper, thank you very much.